Hey guys, before we start, I just wanted to say I've been getting a few comments uh, uh, regarding my inability to uh, grow uh, any decent facial hair. And the reason I try to is because I've either got a baby face like this where I've got zero or two chins, whereas if I got a little stuff there, then it kind of hints that I might have a chin. But I was watching a show recently, a uh, doco, about how you can get transplants from your hair onto your face to grow like a, a mighty beard. And I thought, well, I've got a ton of hair, so I've thought about it. I've, it's a very considered decision. But next week, I will be going into uh, one of these hair treatment places. I'll, I'll sit down with the doctor and I'll say, No thanks! <laughs> Shaboom! And it's time for another Funky Monday video. We get updates on you, me, and everything funky. Very exciting episode because later on, we will be starting the process of designing you and me our very own funk card. Yes, if you missed it last week, we officially, sort of officially, announced our own training card game called Funk Cards. We'll get to it in just a bit because we do have a funky monkey in a bit of a dilemma. He needs our help. Billaby said, any ideas on a simple game? I, I can't find any idea and I lost my interest on that game I was developing, so please help. Oh, sorry Billy, that was actually a little hard to understand. Maybe you should edit that so that it's a bit easier. Oh, you did. Okay. That's, that's what you wanted, was it? Okay, let's get straight into it and design our own funk card. So, still developing all the rules and finalizing everything, but I thought it'd be exciting to start off by sort of collaborating and building our own card. So the way we're gonna do it is, I found this uh, picture in my folder of Samurai Tucker. What a regal, amazing warrior he is. So that will be the design for the artwork for the card, but now I need you developers to help out decide whether this card will be a citizen, like a creature, if you know Magic the Gathering. Will that be Samurai Tucker? Or is this card a spell? Is it like the essence of Samurai Tucker to help out your citizens? Or is it like an artifact, like a thing? Are we equipping this sword onto a citizen? So for this week, I'd like us to vote in the poll card that will pop up soon, whether this card will be a citizen, a spell, or like an artifact, like a thing. So let me know and next week we'll catch up and then do the next step of development. We're, we're game designers. Ugh, sorry if it's getting a bit dark. It is a little cloudy today, but it won't stop us from doing <gasps> a community news. Today we have a very special edition of community news because I'll be getting a lot of comments on who I look like. So today's will be, who does Sam look like? Da -da 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 -da. John Tron's secret brother. Ah, so not John Tron himself, just his, just his secret brother. Ah, uh, you look a little like Jerry Seinfeld. Jerry, oh, that's a flashback, okay, okay. He kind of looks like Chris Reinich. Chris Reinich. Uh, we'll take a rain check. Is it just me, or does anyone think he kind of looks like Billy Joe Armstrong, without makeup? Oh yeah, I can see that, yeah, without makeup, yep. Yeah. You really look like Julian Casablancas. Dance with him, please. Yeah, he's pretty cool, yeah. Maybe I'll hit him up, we can do a collab. Oh yeah, he's like a million times hotter, so don't worry. Ah, oh, uh, all right then. You look like a fat Roman Atwood. A, fa a, a fat one, okay. Why does he look so weird, like his face? Okay, that's enough. Give me a sec. Don't worry, this'll, this'll brighten, your, brighten your day. Ah, oh, that's a bit better, okay. Now it is time for this week's Certified Funky and Sam of Approval, which this week just goes to a snappy commenter, Button Tapper, who left a comment on my bloopers video that it's just like his regular videos, except a little more coherent. Oh, someone's cheeky, uh, but for that we must oh, oh, throw an egg. <laughs> yes, every time that someone wins a Certified Funky and Sam of Approval, we drop an egg in the name, in the elusive cup of Honester. And if the egg splashes and doesn't break, they win themselves a Sam Time Tur shirt available at tershirt.com. Let's drop an egg. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the Funky Time Egg Sports. Here we have our contender totally not committing to that maneuver, but he does get the egg. He presents it to. Well, nobody, I'm the only guy here. It's kind of weird. I'm in a booth in an empty park looking at a guy throwing egg. Hey, oh, he does the shuffle. We haven't seen the shuffle before. And this is for the Tershirts. More like Tershirt. Who oh, no. knew? Oh, sorry there, button tapper. But don't worry, your $5 billion is in the mail. Ah, but until next time, guys, remember, vote in that poll whether you want... Um, it's probably on that side, is it? I don't know. Uh, whether you think this should be a citizen, Samurai Tucker, a spell like Samurai Tucker's Blessing, or a thing like the Funkatana. Let me know in the poll, but until next time, this is Sam Tucker saying, escape the ordinary and embrace the funky. Stay funky, everyone.
Same time, signing off. Subscribe today. Oh, poor old boy can't grow a warrior's beard like me. <laughs> Maybe I should tell him the secret. Now this is all natural. Oh! Funk it down. And I thought, given this artwork, and I thought, and I thought this week, and I thought this week, and this is what, and oh, it's getting a bit dark. Ah! Oh, oh my God! Can you even see me anymore? Look out! It's, that's clouds up there. That's clouds. But I thought that can't stop us from designing our own card. Say something that makes sense, Sam. Oh!